Hello there, what's the story? What's the crack? How are you keeping? This is the Panda Puncher. Yes, Panda Puncher, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4. Welcome to a random Monday live stream. And yeah, I decided that I was quite irked with how uh, this save played out the last time. Um, so I decided I was going to come back, change a couple of things, give it another go. So, first and most important, change the hat. I felt as though that was probably the main reason I. Uh, failed last time. It wasn't the game bugs, it wasn't bad strategy, it wasn't this, that, and the on, it was lack of a hat. So I got a hat. Um, but the second thing we're going to do is that we're mainly going to sort of hold off the Russians and crush the Italians. Stop any of the mess that happened in Southern Europe from happening again. Um, if any of you did catch the live stream last Tuesday, uh, we are starting off exactly from where that live stream started off. Uh, so, essentially, that live stream didn't happen. Um, doing this out of order, as in not on a Tuesday, because Tuesday is my weekly dedicated live stream. So, I am going to keep that for just genuine dedicated scheduled things. And I've scheduled Dwarf Fortress for tomorrow evening. Slightly different from Hearts of Iron, but that's what we're doing. Um, so, yeah, we're going to stop all of our attacks. We're going to delete all of our fronts. We're going to rejig some units and divisions, and we'll probably. How. Uh, you know what? I kind of want you dumped out straight away. We'll let them train for a bit longer. So, we've unread naval battles, convoy raids, they've got some decisions. We haven't been doing decisions in a long time now, so screw that shit. Um, I'm hoping audio and everything is fine. Um, time will tell. Uh, there's justification of war goal against us. That's Italy and Yugoslavia. Insufficient resources. Resistant occupation. And we can invite Greece to the faction. Now, Greece is currently at war with Italy. So, if that can stay available long enough so that we can... Actually, you know what? We are going to deploy all these troops... Uh, we'll get to them in a second once we uh, rejig things over here. So let's get you. I just want the options to delete orders, and that's everybody's orders. Every single one. No, I didn't want. That. That's not what I wanted to happen, but anyway. Uh, we can delete. No. Do as I'm. Delete. Or not. Do I have to select a different army to delete this? There we go. And delete that. I think that's freed up all of our troops. <coughs> so, we just need to leave reasonable numbers behind in order to hold the front against the Soviets, go across the Italians, and then go back to the Soviets. That is the plan. Um, so, I don't know if this stream is going to be. Two hours or 20 minutes, depending on what happens here, because this is the only reason the stream exists, um, is to just give this an alternative um, go. So first and foremost, let's sort out you, sir. You've got some check divisions and five total. Join him. We need to take... These 20 units create a new army for now. Pretty green, but we'll be fine. So you, sir, shall get a front line here with an offensive line of Rome. Uh, new theater. So let's call this the Italian theater. I'm going to have to shimmy about here because my keyboard's all over the place. Italian front. There we go. Done. And I'm going to give you a color that's not the same as every single other fucking unit I have. Um. Well, this is a pretty green army, so I think that makes sense. Right, so they will be our first army at the front. Back to this theater. Okay. 
where are these troops located around this front? So I want to use to hold the Polish border. I think that makes decent sense. So if you can hold the Polish border, that's it. Actually, we'll give you a token attack. Just uh, so you can plan it. Now, Rommel, I would like to pull you off this front altogether and get you to help attack Italy. Doing this in the wrong order, but if we can crush the Italians here and then help reinforce this once they've been pushed out, that'll be good. So offensive line there. But that'll leave this complete front down here pretty exposed, but we'll we'll get we'll get there. Um You can do that front. You're gonna be pretty overextended but again you're not going to be driving forward our only issue is what will the Romanians and Soviets do on this side um, Lord only knows if that'll work so where are you good sir you are up here and you are just going to once again hold that line um, you'll get an offensive line of middle of nowhere there and these troops, I kind of want to sort of leave here. Do I want to leave them here? I do want to leave them here. Um, but I'm just going to get them to sort of straddle these two. F Actually, you know what? You can get this one. No, I want to edit you. God damn, front. Uh, edit bullet. Really? Can I not, like, do a 360 here? There we go. 18 divisions. Offensive line of that. They're going to starve. Don't need to attack straight away. So we have that. So let's bump up the speed 4 and see how this filters out. I do expect to lose ground as we move trips about. Um, no longer on the offense. <laughs> <laughs> Things are happening and I don't like it. Okay. It's fine. Again, Finland, we don't really care about right now. Uh, Rommel, you are going to join the Italian front. Air Innovations is done. Um, do you want to go strategic or tactical air effort? I don't think there's anything else over here. That we want to do. Um, shared R&D program. Uh, we get a couple of buffs to some tank stuff there. Um, and that's for some nuclear stuff. Now let's go to. We'll just actually. Is there any military, basic military stuff that we can do? Just the army innovations that was there. Molotov, Ribbon Drop Pack, we can't do. Um, yeah, we're going to go for your plan. Uh, missing equipment in production. Transport plane, if a bomber, they will remain missing in production. Um, is our troops getting over here? They are. Details. And we shall continue researching. Got a couple of tanks on the go, new planes, all that lovely stuff. Um, right, you're gonna be, you're gonna go straight away. Um, and invite the faction. I don't know how that's gonna go. I could have swore we could have attacked. Do we have to still justify a war goal against them? I thought we might have been... Uh, maybe we'll get the invite to war soon. Not sure, really. Uh, Grace, you're in our faction. 
invite us to your war, please? Or are you just going to capitulate that, uh, for the crack? Apparently so. How's things going here? We are holding off for the most part. Which is all I want to do. It's quite a bit of resources dedicated to holding things off. Lithuania is called Greece as our ally in the German-Soviet War. We have our army down here. It's all just green infantry. Uh, Rommel is there. Fine. I just wish... Can you please, for the love of God, Greece? Okay, well we're at war now. Uh, we'll accept 15 divisions from Belgium. We shall... yep, we'll accept that. We have unassigned divisions. Beautiful. Um, for the most part, that's 15 divisions. Uh, let's get you into an army in the Italian front. Get uh, somebody that's half decent, this guy. And for now, I want you to go there. I'm only doing that temporarily. Because I am going to take some of his troops. Not the green ones. And I'm pressing the wrong buttons. Um, you go there. And you go there. Right, go. Ball steam ahead. Can I not attack from this front? Really? Is that the problem? We've got our war against Italy. You know what? You're going to go. And <clears throat> you are going to have all your orders deleted. Uh, front line from German territory. Offensive line of Rome as well. You're going to go as soon as you can. Um, this army is still going to do what it needs to do. And then it'll hold off any sort of impact that we have with... Pretty sure it'd be okay in a minute. Yugoslavia might join the war against Italy. And we'd be able to attack Italy through Yugoslavia. But for now, we're just going to... Greece has called France as our ally. That is good. Ah, brilliant. That worked out pretty well, actually. Everybody's attacking. How's this front going? Fine. Uh, what about the uh, army? Is this new? Finland has capitulated. It's fine. It's dark times. What army are you, sir? Army seven. Army three. Army five. Army seven. Go. I mean, there's a lot of Italian troops here. I'm just hoping that they're as just as good as real-life Italian troops in World War II. But with a combination of France and us pushing in, it's going to go well. Italy is called Bulgaria, and that isn't cool. Okay, you've done with your war, I think. Yes, you are. So you're going to get a front line against Bulgaria. That's too big of a front line. Let's edit that. No, 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 let's, let's not do that. There we go. Uh, edit. And we shall drag all that back to here. And you will get a front line off the other side of their country. And you'll go when ready. Message from Sweden changes their diplomatic status. Satisfying. 
The sooner we eat up Italian territory, the better. Why aren't you attacking? Uh, no available land route. Um, oh, it's because of Yugoslavia. That's a pain in the ass. Major pain in the ass. Lithuania is called Yugoslavia. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Crush this. Done. Pause. Take you. Get you some new orders. Namely, uh, I'm going to right click your orders down. And offensive line. Uh, basically, there. That'll do the job. That's a mess, actually. Um, delayed orders. Let's try that again. Let's do that. No, well, Yugoslavia can handle that. We're going to take on the Italians here. Um, with a front line of just down here, do the job, and then go when ready. Uh, we get uh, Turkey wants to send volunteers. No problem, Turkish people. Is this front going on? It is holding pretty static. Just have to be cautious of getting cut off here and losing some troops. But for the most part, I like it. I like it. Um, we are pushing in against. Uh, wait, wait, cart, cart. Why are you getting injured? Where are you? Which one's Kurt? Kurt student. He was the one that got injured. Yeah, he's injured. Saying so I need traits to this unit leader. I forgot to keep adding traits to people. Um, Von Manstein can take over. You've got positive uh, percentage for your attack uh, preparedness stuff, but anyway, let's see now. Can we? Huh. Scavenger's probably a good one to grab. Yes. Regardless of who it is, Scavenger's a good one. And we could grab Gorilla Fighter. Uh, after signing this trait, you will have no available trait slots to sign for this general. I haven't really looked too much into traits and all that lovely stuff. But to be honest, I want to see if I can sign traits to my Mr. Rommel. To my Mr. Rommel. Nothing crazy, so Gorilla Fighter. And that's it for now. Uh, I wonder if we upgraded him to Field Marshal. No, that'll reset if you fix. Screw that. And what about uh, the guys number 12? No. Uh, we can sign traits to this guy. Infantry Expert or Ambusher. So we get max entrenchment and recon bonus. Or we can just increase division attack. We are sitting, we're, we are digging in on the Eastern Front right now, so I think it might be worthwhile to consider possibly ambush for the max entrenchment and recon. But at the end of the day, I'm all about the attack, so it's attack. Um, okay, so that's that guy. No traits built for him, him, or. Uh, yeah, we do have some for Von Mantufel. You're gonna get him from your expert as well. Done. I think. Yes. Done and done. So we have planes in reserve. So let's rectify that. Move all equipment. All equipment. Uh, that'll do. You're going to sit here. We're also going to get some close air support, move one, but actually make it 500. And deploy to... Um. Yeah, deploy to Munich. So I can take 1200, I wasn't reading that right. So you'll be air superiority, close air support, interception, 
regular missions. Let's get them over here. Okay, we'll sort that out in a second. We should go into the Alpine region with those mission traits. Where are those unassigned planes? Yeah, that's going to help, right there. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's going to help. Let's get out of airplane mode for a second. Let's see what's going on. Two divisions of Turkey have arrived. Fantastic. Out of date equipment. That would be our tanks. Be light tank. Let's get that on the go. We have something else that's out of date. What is it? Ah, with that, we can start building. Um, yeah. You can go with Again, we're not going to be making a big switch to that anytime soon. Research slot available. Do we want to grab the medium too? I would like a tiger. Hmm. No. Why did I actually do that? I don't know. Stop questioning me. What year is it? It's 40. Um, don't need any of that specifically. Uh, nothing there. Field artillery. No. 41. We could start grabbing some of this stuff. But let's see in land doctrine. Go for. Uh, let's do that. Air wings with no. Where are you then? Standing by. Flight. No. Let's let's redeploy to here. Right. Are you redeployed? Good. Now you're over here. And do your missions and do it, do them well. Simple as. Back to the land screen. How is the war coming over here? We are pushing against Bulgaria. We are pushing the Italians back. And over here we are starting to squeeze them. Which is good. Again, not making the best progress. It's going to be slow and nasty. But I think that Rome is definitely within our reach. And once we tidy up the Baltic states, it's going to be even better. So what do we want to grab next in terms of national ideas? Um, that infrastructure construction speed, which leads to some of this stuff, which, again, we already have Hung uh, Romania aligned. Hungary, I'm pretty sure, is aligned. But we can go for the autarky, which bonus to excavation. I'm going to do that. We have most of the excavations researched. But we can get a bonus for the, uh, the higher numbered ones. Which will always help in the long run. So uh, Bulgaria is collapsing. We are gaining a nice chunk of territory from the Italians, which I am really chuffed about. And we're about to push them out of the Baltic states. Ah, that's what I was afraid of. Right. Um, why is this? None of the plans here are capable of fostering an attack. But, we do that, because we need to liberate our troops. Um, engineering company is complete, so we want to go and grab... Get the assembly line cap, 50% bonus. So this isn't going to go in our favor. So we may lose some trips here. Not what I wanted. How many ants are stuck over here? Quite a few. Is there any way? I mean, I don't know if there is an easy way of uh, fixing this. What about deploying some units? Um, how are they? Oof. Right, deploy. Where are they? They're here. I want to assign you. Um, to this front. Uh, why not? 
these down to there. These, sir, are no longer capable of um, handling this many troops. Do we have any field marshals? You. We can promote this guy. Can I promote this guy. I know he's injured. Uh, he lose skill level. Yep, yep, that's fine. Where did he go? General, 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 General. Field Marshal Kurt. Really, Field Marshal Kurt? Really? Okay, so let's take all the divisions that are in here. I've got a plan. And join that. And get a new commander of somebody that's good at defending. I'll Albert here. Um, whatever army this is. Army 3. I'm going to delete. Uh, right click. No, I want to. Just delete that. Done. You are going to get a front line of that. Okay. It's not perfect. I'm not sure we're going to be able to save these trips at all. No, we're going to get burned. That was unfortunate. There's a lot of good trips there. For the most part, we are holding this line as we take care of the Italians. Once we free up this one of the armies here to go back and sure up that front, then the better. We still have nine units here. I about use all uh, attack that and attack that. We can if we can save them. We can try and save them. It's why not? There are trips at the end of the day. We like them. Let's get the next level of uh, close air support. Do you have outdated fighters now being made? We are on to Fighter 2. What's our... <laughs> our experience is quite high. Let's at least put one into each of these. Then also do two more and that and save. And let's do <coughs> Fighter 2A. It's going to hit our production a wee bit, but... Oh well. It'll do. Come on. Do this for Germany. I mean, freedom and the allies. Yes. Read them. What are we going to grab next? Uh, we're going to grab these. Um, you are now going to get your plans edited, and you're going to help at least hold that back. Right. Just need to be wary of this. Any major push over there, I mean, just just be careful. Now back to the Italians. The front is getting bigger. We are pushing them back. Uh, Van Mustafel is wounded. Uh, he's not on... Uh, he would be the guy on the main, isn't he? No. There we go. Okay, Van Mustafel, let's get you replaced with... This guy. Everything for the most part is quiet here for now. We just need to focus on crushing the remaining forces over here. Right, can we try and take that? Uh, absolutely, why not? Let's knock this down a bit, speedways, so we can just sort of keep on top of things. Because speed 5 is a bit crazy for the size of war that we are currently in. Why not just taking that? It's goddamn idiots. Oh, 
over there before this guy gets into that province. Come on. Good. Get over here. Or not. Yep, pushing them all back there. Some Yugoslavian destroyers. And these can sort of hold up just for a minute. Whilst we tidy up everything else, get division planning back, all that lovely stuff. Can we please get rid of these guys? Sooner the better. There we go. I can't believe that the, they're holding out so much. If we could just clean up the Italians here, that'd be good. You know what, no, you can come up this way. The attack here is going well enough that we can afford to splice off a few um, these troops to help sort of just poke around here and try and clean up this Bulgaria situation as quickly as possible. At least get them off our front, which would be great. Highly unnecessary, but... Why risk it? Um, can we get some trips you know, attacking in there please? That'd be good. Can we finish that? Yeah, we've tidied that up. Oh, we need to keep an eye on this. Uh, ooh, a bit like that. We are getting pushed back a wee bit by the Soviets in some areas. But then it's sort of tit for tat for the most of the front. Except down here is a we're a wee bit stretched. Can we, like, just kill these Italian guys or whatever's going on here? Why aren't you attacking? I don't know. But, for now, let's uh, get these two guys back on the attack. It's not really going to work, is it? Nope. Hold you there. I've got a plan. Got a plan. Got a plan. May not work, but I've got a plan. That's all that matters. It's not the validity or the likelihood of one's plan succeeding that is important. It's that one has a plan in any form whatsoever. And we're just about to take Sophia. Hopefully that'll make them capitulate. That'll clean up the front massively. Fingers crossed. Gary has capitulated. Pause this bad boy. Great news! Took some equipment and stuff. Now, let's beat this guy. Yeah, let's just continue with your attacks as are. And how are we? Ah, uh, the fucking Soviets crossed over here. Army 9, or the Army with 9 divisions. You're gonna delete your orders. Put them there. That's it. Um, which army is this? This one. We are going to have a fallback lane. Of there. And I'm going to reduce your front to that I just need to make our front smaller because this is just this is a pain in the ass at the minute um, this guy no this is the one I want and he's just hurry up and crush these guys for the love of whatever it is we're talking about. Autarchy is complete. What do we want to grab next? Uh, we'll grab this group of six civilian factors. Decisions, anything I want to... Yeah, war propaganda against Italy. That's great. Um, what does this get us? Uh, war support's great at the minute. Stability is... 
fine. That's a building slot. Don't care for that. I don't care for any of those. Um, national stuff. Extensive conscription. Limited exports. War economy. Everything else is as we want it to be. So, yeah. Um... I know I'm checking my phone. Don't judge me. I have a life outside of streaming. Um, let's clean this up. We don't have any orders. Let's very quickly get you some orders. Uh, it's not what I was intending, but it'll do. And then we get back up here and hopefully, like, not have died completely. You know what? All these guys get over here, what the fuck? That's really sick that they got another port. Why is this going over here? I'm sort of holding. Let's just crush these guys, tidy that up, get this army back over onto the other front. Are we done? So close. Done. Right. You, you need orders. Pull that gap in. You're gonna attack. Just give. Um, who's the other army that's getting stuck here? Are you serious? That's oh, Romanian troops. I don't care about the Romanian troops. Edit mode. Let's bring your front. You don't have. Choose to join that one. Go. Hopefully, before we get cut off, it'd be great. of everything else. We've got our trips going back there. We're going to try and tidy this up. Um, else we're on the front. Soviets are pushing out a wee bit. Um, more than a wee bit. Let's see who's in this one. This be you. Let's edit your front. You need to protect the entire Polish front. Except for that bit. Um, I've already assigned you to your mission. You're gonna have to be extended, good sir. To incorporate that. You're being redeployed. You're being redeployed. Fine. Now, let's see, we've got 1.53 million logistics. We are hemorrhaging. Hemorrhaging supplies. And that's why we still don't have anything produced. So the sooner we can clean up this Italian stuff, the better. We are at war. This is the German-Soviet war. Is Italy being brought into it? Well, this could go on for a while. Um, this I really need these troops out of here. What are these? Are these like a no orders or something? Unable to find a valid path to the target.
This army is going to get heavily edited again. Uh, that be this one. I sincerely hope. Yeah, and we are going to actually delete that. Get an actual spirit of that, and you're going to go. Please try and save our trips here. That's a far too many trips here to be losing. Far too many. Decimated. <sighs> Dino speed for a second. Let's pause a second, actually. Okay. this mess down here a lot quicker than what you're doing. Better before you get cut off here as well. Now you're being held back. Can we please let me select your goddamn units? The sooner we can get this little province, the better. So we can see if some of these goddamn drifts. Assassination of Leon Trotsky, that's terrible. So terrible. battles going as well as you can expect. Please get this province. I know I'm not dead yet, but uh, things are going a lot better than they would have been um, in the last time I was playing this. So for those you're just watching, not talking. Uh, Fiddle Snail asking, am I dead this yet? Of course, this is the second time I'm giving this a go. I uh, last time ignored the Italian question. Focused all my uh, forces on the Soviet Union. Managed to take Moscow and the cost of taking Stalingrad, all that kind of stuff. Then other wars were going on. I ignored people's calls to come in as ally. And all of a sudden, one of those wars ended. All my sort of allied nations capitulated for like no reason. So Finland, Sweden, Norway, Lithuania, Belgium, all these people just flipped communist and Italians had swathes of territory all over the map, so the Soviets, it was a fucking disaster. And all my armies were cut off, about 80 provinces behind enemy territory. So I decided, you know what, I'll give it another go and try and rectify the problem by not making the same mistake. Issue this time is just are you serious trips get out of there 
Um, I am focusing on the Italians. We're pushing into Northern Italy here quite well. We've pushed Italy completely out of here. We've taken out um, Bulgaria. The Soviets are causing us issues along this front. And we are in the cusp of losing quite a few trips down here simply because um, we can't hold the front. And they're getting surrounded. So, Unassigned divisions. Ah, oh, shit, okay. Um, who here? Oh, you need troops. You're not gonna. You're, you're screwed, just. Simple as. Uh, could you. Yeah, okay. Uh, you can stop your attack. We've saved as many trips as we're gonna save. All these German trips. All, uh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 units are going to die. get to them. I can't sacrifice any trips uh, to that effort. Um, it's just as simple as that. But we are making inroads here. Slowly. I think I kind of want the Russians to pay for, you know, killing my trips. Just they're retreating, they're screwed. Okay, I'm about to get routed. Right, now let's change our plans here. Uh, let's delete that. Let's get you. Uh, can you please, for the love of God, just. Okay, they can't cross there apparently. Um, okay, you can help do that with a offensive line somewhere over there. Soon we will push back against the Soviets once realized. Thanks for. Uh, it is a nice hat. Um, made it myself. Uh, it is a glorious hat. I think you're saying that in jest, especially with the little monkey face. Don't appreciate it at all. Here, see, see uh, you Turkish trips, um, British trips. Etc. Etc. Like there's a war going on, like right there. Just you can probably see it. You know, lend a hand, maybe. Don't be a dick. It's always a good tactic, like. Okay, so this front is going to be pretty static for now. Finland is sort of screwed. Erwin Rommel, Ruben, no! Why Erwin Rommel? He's so cool. Stop it! God damn it! Uh, Mantufel is going to take his place temporarily. Uh, in that case, those attacks aren't succeeding on the Italian side of things, so let's not waste resources. That's going to be hard to get rid of. Romanians are still holding out. Uh, they are holding out simply because they are at a port and they're getting supply and it's like fair play lads. I mean that's that's impressive. Look. We're just dug in along his front, tit for tat. Um attack, defend, attack, defend. Then over here we are purely attacking. How about everybody attack this little province? Lulls. See what we can do. The grand plan is, right, to push the Italians out of here, let this army regroup, and launch a naval invasion from, say, here to here. If possible. I know to do the naval invasion we might have issues around air superiority and all that jazz. We are holding. We are pressing. 
Soviets are being douchebags, but then it's the natural disposition of a Soviet. And yeah, the war is slowly progressing. If we could hook up with the French here. Hold on, now, let's see. Can we influence Swiss neutrality? Uh, yeah, let's guarantee independence, sure, why not? Can't get military access. Uh, request a license to produce foreign equipment for your own use. Like what? Is there anything that we they have that we don't? Light anti-air. They will not accept. God damn Swiss. Your stupid neutrality. What is their tech tree like even? They go down all this effort, but then they don't once the way we fight uh, well, they've got war support. Okay, fair enough. Dicks. Let's see, can we get the Brits involved? It's already in a faction. Hmm. What's their opinion of us? Not great. Let's improve relations. Yes, send. Uh, West Landlies? Let's get some infantry equipment. They will accept. I like that they are accepting. <gasps> Should we invite Ireland to our faction? Must guarantee Irish independence. Fucking right. Uh, <clears throat> Ireland is democratic and needs world attention at 100% to join a faction. Um, okay, that's weird, but improve relations, sure, why not? I've got these experience points to burn, like, <coughs> uh, not guaranteeing your independence, you're big enough. Improve relations, um, why won't you join? Uh, they won't accept, it's fine. Request land lease. I would like some field equipment. I'm gonna send it anyway, dicks. Not accepting, bastards. Um, improve relations with the Canadians. Quest land lease of infantry equipment. They're not going to accept. It's okay. Two thousand rifles. Um, that's fine. That's good. So once again, holding, finishing off. It's going to get tougher and tougher as the Italian forces get concentrated. And as long as we don't get pushed back here, I'm good with holding for now. Especially until we start, you know, improving our logistics. That's our construction. I haven't taken a look at it in a while. So we, we do have a shit ton of stuff. We just need more. Because uh, why not? Um, military factories. Just bunches of them. Good build here. And um, let's get a wee naval dog actually here. A level 10 one. Uh, some oil refineries that I don't care about. It's fine for now. What's what are we. That's resistance to occupation. Fine, fine, fine. Okay. Um, I have been streaming for 55 minutes, people. So I am on that note before we. Progress any further. I'm gonna take a little five minute break, get a drink, all that, you know, normally stuff you do during a break. And yeah, I shall be back in five. Ooh.